This is supposed to be the fun episode anyway. Yeah. I'm not drinking this anymore. <laughs> I'm good. Hi, I'm Travis Cook. I'm Jared Hatfield, and this is Tablet Tips. But not your everyday Tablet Tips. No, sir. These are those things that you shouldn't do in class. Instead of increasing your productivity, we're going to show you how to decrease it. Now, these are those things when you're not in class, when you're just bored in between classes. Have it. Have it all the time. Don't do them in class because your teacher does notice, and don't be surprised if your grade just kind of disappears. So the, you always see the people in class playing. Oh wait, we're not in class, playing World of Warcraft. But you got a tablet. That's mm. yes, it is. I guess nice to have your little lady paladin playing around. But I tried this once. Navigating World of Warcraft with a tablet pen is impossible. Don't don't try it. You'll end up dying quickly. You're better off playing Line Rider. It's a much more simple game. It's a lot of fun things. You draw a circle and some little guy rides it. Th those flash games that like are hard with a mouse? The impossible uh -huh. quiz. You gotta move your mouse and avoid the places? Well, when your mouse can magically teleport from one side to the other, not avoiding that, those things. Not that impossible. It's pretty much a joke quiz after that. So, if you like the challenge in those games, don't use your tablet. And there's just, a, in general, a lot of Flash games that are fun with a tablet. Um, any kind of jazz ball type thing, ink ball. It's yeah, ink balls. Yeah, that's the built-in to Windows. It comes with it. But you don't even have to have an internet connection. In fact, you don't have to have anything other than your basic tablet. It's called doodling. I've drawn some killer smiley faces. Let me tell you. Now you can doodle with like anything in Windows. It supports ink, so it's like OneNote. That's Journal. But wait, you got Paint. Paint's a good one. Paint's amazing. Photoshop, if you're so inclined, Photoshop. you can do some really cool stuff. And just photo editing and picture editing in general, if you need to get those. Always great to upload a picture of your very favorite teacher and do this. Pretty amazing. But again, another disclaimer, just for the sake of covering this, don't do this in class. You this is what play. not to do in class. You should not be playing Line Rider in class. We've you been sitting in class watching other students do this, and there is a connotation between students who do this and students who drop out. But... Just because you spent all that money on that nice fancy tablet and use it to take all those nice, very thorough, very complete, like, all you get every word of those teachers, but everything they say. have some fun with it. These tablets are an amazing tool for fun. It's great for the artists, it's great for the video gamers, which normally those groups don't overlap, so we got a pretty wide... Yeah, well, they can. They can, maybe. Other stuff to do on your tablet involves tablet ball. This is a dangerous thing. We only recommend this if you don't like your tablet. Take your tablet. Throw it. Throw it. It's amazing. If you don't like your tablet, that might be something to do, but yeah. we like our tablets. If you have the accidental warranty cover, it's great. <laughs> now, in all seriousness, this is the fun episode of Tablet Tips. It's spring break. We don't want really want to be doing this right now, so this is for you. One thing that's not fun to do, it's just kind of fun that once you become a tablet user, you do it. Is you use the scratch out gesture. I don't know how many tests I have with four little lines drawn on it. On your tablet, that's out. the thing where you just scratch back and forth and it disappears. You get on the paper and you go, and then you make a big smudge. And then you go, oh, why didn't it work? Sometimes it doesn't work. And you do it again. And then you have this giant ink pencil stain mark going through the paper. Anywhere. That's always fun to do. It works in two directions also. I'm at, try to catch yourself. How often do you use, if you have a digitizer with the eraser, eraser hand, erase, wipe, and blow? How often do you do that? How catch them doing it all the time? Next time you see somebody do that, laugh at them. Make sure you tell them. Point. Point, point of view. But yeah, we've uh, essentially accomplished nothing this type of tip. So that? hopefully you've learned absolutely nothing from this. We've tried to inform you as little as possible and mainly just tell you the random things that we experienced do. tablet users have. Accumulated? Done. D yeah, done. In fact, check out our show notes. We're going to have links to some of our favorite tablet action flash games. Yes, they'll be so. The show notes for this show will be posted and contain all the resources you need to waste time that is in between classes. If Jared does them, because I'd never actually do most of the show notes. For Thanks for watching Tablet Tips. See you next time. Good.